me. You're the Spectre, right? Commander Shepard, it is an honor to speak with you. What's this demonstration about? I'm Charles Saraceno of the Terra Firma Party. With Armistice Day coming soon, we're making our voices heard by the alien appeasers on the Presidium. Can I count on your support in the next election? You're marking the end of the first contact war with a protest? As we have every year for the last 26 years. The war taught humanity a lesson that some would forget. If we don't stand up for ourselves, no one else will. What are you running for? I'm seeking one of the five spacer seats in Parliament. They have certain Baroque conditions for a citizen to be able to vote for them. You have to spend more than six months a year in space, but you can't have stayed in any one settled system for more than a month. You do spend most of your time in space, Commander. I don't know Terra Firma's platform. What do you stand for? Our core value is that Earth must stand firm against alien influences, politically, culturally, and in the worst case, militarily. Glad to see some humans growing a backbone. Excuse me, I don't believe human politics are any of your business. My business is whatever I say it is. We live in this galaxy, Mr. Saraceno. We can't pretend that what we do affects no one else. No, of course not. My apologies. I only meant to point out that other species have no right to interfere in Alliance politics. I'm a patriot, Mr. Saraceno. You've got my vote. It is gratifying to hear that. We can't allow anything like Shanxi to happen again. Since I have your vote, could I convince you to issue a public statement of support for my candidacy? The support of the first human specter would be invaluable. It's inappropriate for an active duty officer to publicly comment on politics. Of course. I apologize for making the request. Thank you for your time, Commander. Remember Terra Firma on Election Day, because Terra Firma remembers you.